Adelaide and Gold Coast both look to be ready for this enticing matchup. Anthony Hudson with you as we prepare for this one. They've turned on the weather here in Adelaide. A reasonable turnout for this match. And joining me as always is Gary Long. Cheers, Hutto. Today should be a good match. Even though this is an exhibition match, Hutto, we expect that both teams still want to win. Well, today it's Adelaide versus Gold Coast. They run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp. And the crowd are appreciating it. The cheer squad's hard work is paying off. The banners are looking great. It's a big midfield battle today. Whichever team can get on top in the middle of the ground will walk out winners today. They look ready and rearing, and the crowd are right behind them. I'm really looking forward to seeing how they play today. That's true, Hutto. The captains prepare for the toss of the coin. Gold Coast wins the toss. Both sides look ready to get into the action just moments away now. And here we go. It's Adelaide taking on Gold Coast. Watson on the ball. Puts on a ball. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaze? I'm really enjoying this one, Hutto. Linking by hand. Handball finds Cramey. She takes aim. Takes the mark all by herself. Thompson with a chance, if she can keep her cool. Thompson just threw it. Chose to kick it. Gets into some space to mark this. Riley tucks it into the pocket. Norston used the body to take that mark. Kicks it out of the back half. Nice hands. Puts boot to ball. Stuck the mitts out there and held on to it. Watson works the ball up the ground. They chase after the loose ball. Thump clear. Virgo impressively steps around. Use the hands and gives away the free. A chance to gather the ball. Great tackling technique. Jones got herself a free. She doesn't want to let her teammates down with this shot at goal. It has to be a big kick to get it from there. Thank you, Ahmed. We'll get a ball up. McKinnon won it. Stanton kicks it. Phillips picks up the loose ball. Movement by hand. Searching for a teammate. Decides to play on. Kassler kicks it out of the back 50. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Big kick required from this distance. The kick will be from a 45 degree angle. Going for goal number one. Now we get the set up the final way to stop the ball moving. Adelaide doing well at the moment. Considering the options on the kick in, Kasslake decides to go herself. Looks up with a kick. Gathers it now. Thompson dug out the loose ball. No issues with that drop. She acknowledges the crowd. Adelaide gets the first goal on the ball. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. 
This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. The game is back underway. One down. Phillips won herself a free. Chips it towards half forward. Randall spills it. Shear hacks it on the boot. McKinnon throws the ball away. A long driving kick. What a talent! What a mark! Adelaide are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Stanton drops the mark. Slick with the hands. Lee grabbed it clean. Manages to get a hand away. Fighting hard was Cox. Cox turns a free kick. Going for goal number one. I think it's got the legs. It's there. Celebrating hard. The Crows could kick the last two goals. 14 points the difference. It's great to watch, Hutto. Plenty of excitement. That's a really good team goal. Back in the middle now. Foley just slaps it down. Controlled well off the bounce. Sends it clear of the contest. Hickey couldn't hang onto the ball. Collects the loose ball. And scissors it off. Hurried kick. Taking a nice grab. Now with a low spearing kick. Foley takes a strong mark. Adelaide have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. Virgo puts it on the boot. Picked up now. Yorston going for distance with the kick. Strong with the body and wins the mark. Quick hands and there could be a way here. Great tackle. The handball hits the target. My ball, says the umpire. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? It's a really entertaining game of football. McKinnon won it down. Ernst controls this one. Yorston finds her teammate on the move. Takes it well. Adelaide can the lead, but they're allowing plenty of... The Suns with a lot to think about as they trail by 14. Adelaide grew up and about early, and I bet the coach would be happy with this lead at quarter time. Anything you can see, Gary? Gold Coast are playing a very controlling game. They're taking... The siren sounds for the start of the second quarter. About to resume hostilities. Bala thumps it forward. She's got the football now. Quickly onto the boot. Ernst finds the ball on the move. Keeps the kick low. Foley receives the ball. Missed the target. Gets the handball away. Riley slams it onto the boot. Marino gathers it now. Manufactures the handball. Strong mark in the contest. 50 metres from home. Thompson should be able to put this through. Move it on. Looking to kick goal number two. That's something to smile about. Pretty happy with that one. Adelaide have three in a row. Adelaide by 20 points. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. A great bit of play that resulted in that goal.
Gold Coast needs to do a better job and gain more clearances at the moment. They're getting beaten in the contest and it's affecting the scoreboard. Swatson, here's Phillips, uses the hands instead of the body and it's a free kick. Phillips kicks it. Ball gets cut off. Picks up the loose ball. The loose ball picked up. Scoops up the ball. Mules. Read it first. Ball was taken high in the tackle. Takes a few deep breaths before this important kick. Big kick required from this distance. She likes her chances from here. It was always pushing that post and pushing it so hard, it hit it. Adelaide with the ascendancy over Gold Coast, leading 21 to 0. With a burst of speed, sees it out of play. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? This game needs a spark at the moment. McKinnon got a fist to it. Ernst lobs the handball. Shows some physicality. Collected by Phillips. Puts it right through the middle. That's her first. And that puts them further in front. Oh, look at her. She really enjoyed that one. The lead is now 27. Back in the middle to resume play. Foley with a big fist on it. Phillips drives it out of the pack. Easily takes the mark. 45 metres out, should be relatively straightforward from here. Going for goal number one. They are happy with that effort. This kick puts them further into the lead. She's enjoying that goal. That's five in a row for Adelaide. The lead is now 33. Hammers it. Cramey keeps coming. Slams it on the boot. Randall found some space and marked. A spearing kick. Winning the ball in the air was McKinnon with a driving kick. The mark is taken by Gunn. 45 metres out. She takes aim. Oh, what about that? That was really special. She sinks her first goal. This lead getting bigger now. Gump love kicking that one. She knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. She did really well there and gets the reward. About to resume play. Won it down. Just goes bang. Stanton got the hands free. Quick hands, and they could be away here. Moves the ball by foot. Great mark. 45 metres out. Almost directly in front here. They really need a goal on the board now. Goal! That will settle her nerves. Gets her first on the board. Puts it through. And that goal with the start of something more. Puts it through. Look at them celebrate that effort. Bala hurls it away. Collected the ball well. Big tackle. Opportunity for Cox. She gets her hands on the footy. Fourth with the ball. Fourth just through it. Looks to move it by foot. Berge wins the marking contest. Searches for a teammate downfield. Stanton uses the body well. Adelaide just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside the Alex to kick. She got up high, but couldn't bring it down. With the ball as Gam, she drives it towards goal. Miss for the
the margin is 34. Looking to bring it back into play. Finds a target. You've seen a half now, Gaz. Your thoughts? Adelaide could control the play well and deserve this lead at halftime. Contemplates her next move. Well, I hope you enjoyed that first half. Back soon with a second half action. The third quarter has begun. Back with another centre bounce. Punches are clear. Made the tricky bounce look easy. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gas? I'd love for the coach to send a message out there and tell these players to take the game on. Adelaide crew allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Move it on. Go for goal number one. The Crows fans getting excited about that one. The lead has been increased by Katja. She's excited about that one. Now they lead by Gordon. Back in the middle. Has the rucks go at it. Punched away. A quick handball from Phillips. Good mark by Ernst. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Adelaide forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. Seen plenty of it. Stanton gets the handball away. Phillips wins the foot race. She's picked up an injury. Going straight to the rooms. Does not look good. Thank you. Bala just swats it away. Foley collects the loose ball. Stanton hacks it out of there. Intercepts the ball well. Radzic uses it by foot. Gunn has a great set of hands. Uses it across half back. Hampson marks in a bit of space. Doesn't waste any time. Lobs the handball. Slams it onto the boot. Doesn't hold onto the mark. Finding the loose ball was Kassler. She gains the possession. She has the ball. Watson going for number one. It's a big kick. And it goes straight through. They get a rounder after that effort. Gold Coast fighting hard, but still with work to do. Foley with a big fist on it. She looks like she needs a spell, putting her skills on display. Umpire is going to ping her here. Outstanding pressure. Goes by foot. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Stabs at the kick. Watson found a way to mark that one. Got boot to ball. Riley brings the ball in the air. Adelaide just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Ball up on the outer side wing. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? I'm waiting for something to change the way this game's going right now. Great attack on the ball, Gary. Just through the ball. Goes for territory. A solid mark from Gia. Uses it now. Doing well to intercept that kick. Puts it on the boot. Finds a target. Adelaide haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning title that way. Ball off hands. She likes her chances from here. 
smiles all round. That's two in a row for Gold Coast. Gold Coast, close the gap to 28. Centre bounce. Thrashes it. Wins the race to the ball. Gore throws the ball away. Uses it by foot. Watson got under it. Sinks the slipper into it. Ends up turning this ball over. Hatcher goes for territory. McKinnon takes a strong mark. How did you see the third term, Gaz? Adelaide believe they can win this game. It's time to show it. Watson having an impact right now. She's on fire at the moment. One quarter of footy to go. They need to get a move on if they're going to win from here. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. She can take off after that handball. She gets another possession. Great mark in the pack. Plays on quickly. He's in her possession. It's only in the hole. Margin in a really tricky situation. Plays on from the kick in. Allen just manages to release the kick. A piercing kick from Phillips. Has to do better than that in the mark contest. Foley sends one up towards the wing. Van Hagen sends one up towards the wing. Adelaide are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Couldn't keep the ball in play. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? There's not enough effort out there at the minute. She's got the football now. Just gets it onto the boot. Couldn't snaffle it. I haven't seen her for a while, Gaz. She needs to find a way into this game. Watson moves it by hand. Intercepted. I haven't seen her for a while, Gaz. She's barely touched the ball lately. Sweeping handball. Gets a quick kick away. Just got the hands in the back there. Van Hagen goes with the kick. An easy grab for Randall. The Crows have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. Allen pushes a low ball. Watson uses the body well. It has to be a big kick to get it from there. Going for goal number three. Wants to keep it moving. Kramey on the ball. Marks now and can send it back. Moved on by Pittman. Ends up marking uncontested. Works it across the ground. A solid mark from Watson. She can put it through. She'll have to do better than that next time. Gold Coast reduced the margin, ready to bring it back into play. Good grab there from Branchitz. With a driving kick. Open opportunity for Randall. Punches the kick. Takes a simple grab. Links with hands. They can link up now. Off hands from McKinnon. Mops up the loose ball. Penetrating handball. This is Kessler finding the ball with ease. The ball mopped up. The tackle slipped high and results in a free. She heads for home. Unable to put that one through. Gold Coast reduced the margin. Allen to kick it in. Foley grabs that one. 
Uses it by foot. Takes an uncontested mark. Adelaide can the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of the game if they're to stay on top. Randall drives it out of defensive 50. Takes a strong mark. Advances now. Considine just throws it. Watson gets the opportunity to have a shot for goal. Might be too far out to score. Lining up from a 45-degree angle. She decides to go for home. Kept her head and kicked the goal. That's worthy of celebration. She's enjoying every second of it out there. She's giving it all she's got this match. That's number three. Bella won the hit out. Kicks hurriedly. Adelaide fans rejoice after a great performance here today. Sometimes you're just happy to walk away with the four points. They weren't at their best, but they did what they had to do. At the end of the match, Adelaide defeated Gold Coast 46 to 27. That's all the time we have for today. It's been a great day of football, and we'll see you again soon.